Ladies and gentlemen, this is what it's all about. Behind this door is the first 2025 Newell Coach. I heard you've got something special to give us a sneak preview of. We do, it's a sneak peek. It's not quite finished, but we are gonna let you see the 2025 Tampa Show Coach. It's about a month away from being completed, but guess what, you're here, so why not take advantage of it? Come on. This is a show coach. We get this show coach has been sold, so we did some unique things for show coach. The customer actually came up with a great idea. If you kind of look, it's a very nice matte finish on the exterior. Ryan Louts, once again. They deal with this matte finish all the way through. The white, blue, silver, and uh, black is all matte finish, even on the fades and everything. Very talented. We even included some good drop shadows with the mat, we think it's gonna really set off very, very well. And once again, this is also gonna be a blackout coach too. So no chrome, see right there, the black wheels. It really go good with that matte finish, we feel. Yeah, absolutely, and this coach is still in production, yes. so it's still missing some of the marker lights. Notice, if you notice back here in the back, you're still missing the null badging. Back right here, you see the outline that we just started doing. Still has some holes where some lights and uh, different things will be going. Yes, sir, but the interior of this one is what it's all about. Yeah, this is a very, very nice coach. I love these matte colors. The camera does not do justice, but if folks want to see this one in person, it is going to be at the Tampa Super Show? Yes, it will be at the Tampa Super Show. We'll be proudly displaying at the Tampa Super Show. And how can you miss it? You'll see it, I believe we're outside again this year, but you'll see just off the nose. Look how pretty that is. Now, we are also have the Newell badging that will be up front here. My mirrors will be uh, mounted on the top on this particular coach as well. I do have to ask you, this being a show coach, obviously there's some customization stuff that yes. was done to this coach that I've never seen before in a Newell coach. What is the process for someone ordering a coach and how many show coaches a year are available? And if someone wants to purchase a brand new Newell, what are some of the options they have? If you like to order a new coach, we do build four show coaches a year roughly, and this is one of them, but this one is pre-sold. We'll let the uh, customer develop it and create it because it is going to be their coach. We're just going to show off what we did. There's a few custom coaches that are going through production right now that we're gonna try to get the camera on while we're here in Miami, Oklahoma. Yes. And Newell's definitely been doing some wild custom stuff. Is there any limits to what Newell Coach can do uh, in customization? We have limits, so they're expanded. Can we show everyone uh, inside of this 2025? Let's go check it out. Josh, this is a totally different feel than we've ever seen in any other coach. What's so different about this? Well, he walked in, he saw a very open space. His customer did not want a passenger seat in it. However, we did put a base in there for down the road for resale value. I definitely really like this, you know, really wide entry, just gives it a completely different feel having that open space. But what are some of the reasons why someone would opt to not have a passenger chair? A lot of our customers may not actually drive or be in travel in their coach. They may use it as a destination coach. And that's in this particular situation, that's probably what it's gonna be. So they have a higher driver and there's really no need for a passenger seat. So a lot of people may take the pat, remove the passenger seat for shoe storage, just kind of opening it up more space, making it feel more open as you enter the coach. A lot of really cool design cues that we've seen in some previous Newells that have all come together in this coach, but what else is going on here, sir? Yeah, a lot going on here, actually. Let's start at the bottom here. We start with a real wood floor. Yes, sir. And we took that floor, we kind of match it with the dash. You know what we don't usually have is sometimes we usually have a carbon fiber look yes, right sir. here in this. We decided to do the wood matching look into the dash. It really sets it off really nice and it matches it very, very well. And with the real wood floor, we don't really do it that often. Most times it's a porcelain or a tile type floor. Some we do very few carpets, but really we don't do a lot of real wood. Really sets the tone, really sets the tone. It's a lighter coat, so it feels really big and roomy, which it is which is one of the reasons why people come to us for an oil coach for that room. Speaking of room, we have a 15 foot, seven inch long slide with an 84 inch sofa. That's a seven foot long sofa, Andrew. You being well over six feet, you can easily lounge in this sofa, no problem, while enjoying your 50 inch TV. And does this turn into sleeping? It does turn into sleeping. Funny you should ask, cause it is a true queen size hide a bed sofa. 
a seven a seven foot long sofa will give you plenty of width and space to give you that queen sleeping for your guest yeah sir and of course the design team knocked it out of the park with the two-tone finishes yes. and then the style of this ottoman is very cool uh, we've started to see more of those pop up in recent coaches what's what's this ottoman up well, here this is a david ottoman i think uh we just kind of call it after the person that invented it uh david panel came up with this open style ottoman here don't offer any stores but it does give it a good unique look kind of modernizes a little bit a little different than our standard ottoman shows a little change yes sir and then the ceilings in this coach really have that kind of spa really relaxing well, I'm glad you pointed that out because we first started doing this in coach 1749 this we did the straps very straight so it kind of just different drives the flow of it and we match it with this good looking veneer material right here so it really flows very well what's really great about this remember last year in 2024 we did a lot of indirect lighting yes sir we introduced a lot of indirect lighting and this year we're doing more of a straight slide fascia kind of makes it feel even more open in here so you don't have the curve coming out or anything with that nice indirect lighting it really sets the tone very well so really from floor to ceiling we customized this coach for the customer but also was able to show a lot of great features in 2025 or future customers maybe wanting to put an order in. Coming over to this side, that oh, yeah. is a huge TV. Probably that is. one of the biggest TVs I've seen in a motorhome. What is going on it back is here? It is a 77 inch TV. We, the customer decided to have that in place of the window. I just like to say, Noel's known for their big windows, big slides, tall slides. So if you have a big, tall slide, you can put a big TV in. It'll be great for entertaining. We also did something really neat as well is this coach right here, this is a monitor, and we're able to put it in the side window, kind of hidden away, so they have a timing and scoring for their different events they'll be at this particular customer. So therefore, they can sit at the table and keep a live updates on what's going on outside their motorhome while they're enjoying their motorhome at the track. Yeah, very cool, very cool. And then these newer style recliners we've started to see yes. in recent coaches. A lot of these recliners, and we're going to mess up Amber's beautiful work here, but uh, we've got to show these things off. I'm going to pop this out here. You have a nice headrest. Yeah, then you've got those nice blankets. Now, do those blankets come with the coach? We'll, we'll supply you with a lot of blankets and a lot of pillows. We'll make sure you're very comfortable. And it really also helps with the decor accents of the coach. You have to flow the coach look very well. We want to make it like yours, your residential home. You're going to have blankets in your living room, so why not put blankets in your living room in your motorhome as well? Your design team is at the top of the game for sure. They so. are, they are. You got to give our design team a lot of credit. They do a great job, Amber said, and this really everyone does. And, you know, they, they really work well with everyone in the factory. A lot of this stuff is upholstered in-house. In fact, 90% of it is. I like this because it kind of like is a transformer. It goes from like a little chair to a really big, good size recliner. Good perspective seeing both of them. Very sleek style, but very functional as well. And then we have this driver console as well that yeah. that can go slide up by the driver while you're going down the road. You know, once again, why not take advantage of what we give you? This is not mounted, so a lot of people use it while they are in their recliners as a little end table. Yeah, and have you guys ever done a, a TV this big in a motorhome before? Or? We have before. We have. A lot of it comes with us. Some of our unique uh, sports guys, such as this, want it because they're trying to make it feel more residential at home. And it really works out really well because how TVs are, they're so flat, sleek, and nice now. You really can't even tell. Yeah, it almost looks like it could be a window if it you didn't really know. Could. I, I want to check out this half dinette behind you, but my... My attention is getting drawn here to the middle of the coach. There's some really <laughs> cool stuff going on. What's what's going on down here? What What's well, going on? Well, first off, you got to ignore this. This coach is under production, so this is a plumbing line for a coffee maker. So that has not been installed yet, hence that's why we had the 110 outlet. But let's start here from the bottom. A unique bourbon storage area. These uh, Lazy Susans actually cut out from whiskey barrels. Really? Yeah, this kind of add a little nice facade to the coach. And then they went off and matched this. Now you're going to see this back in the shower. You know, we're always trying to tie the coach in together. So when we get back to the master bath, you're going to see this as, as your back uh, shower piece. Now, going down the road, I'm a little bit concerned. 
if the driver makes a hard right turn, do we need to be concerned or? We recommend you put the wine up. Okay, that's only trans. for when you're. That's only, this is not, we do have pieces right here, but we do recommend you please put the wine up. This is just <laughs> a nice little display spot. And the accent wall really ties in well with the ceiling and the floors in this coach. These light colors, uh, but still a warm, a really nice feel inside of this coach. It really does have a really nice feel. And I like how we, straight face of this and put that right here for indirect lighting really pops it off and it keeps the consistency going through but what i really need to do is do another spin around so we got some really another cool feature to show off here in the kitchen i don't know if y'all saw the party coach we had coach 1781 but it had the invisa cooktop in it this is an invisa cook works it's pretty much an induction cooktop you have these mats that you'll put right here this gives you a lot more counter space flow so you don't have a big cooktop right here it just hides it and keeps the flow going very well and this is a porcelain cooktop so it does not hurt you can put porcelain over and it works just fine it is wild the technology that they're coming up with and newell's always cutting edge too i don't think we've seen that in any other motorhome i think that's another first at newell coach well we have to be we are expected to be that because we are the best and we have to always keep on constantly innovating and that's why we have a great team of people doing that yes sir on that note i gotta ask you what is the price of a 2025 newell coach to have all the latest and greatest it does come at a price tag. What what are we looking at? It does average around two and a half million dollars. It is a custom coach, custom fit for you. Yes, sir. Now getting to this range, you know, owner someone spending that kind of money on a motorhome can choose just about any motorhome in the world. What is it about Newell Coach that people choose to spend that two point five million with you guys? Uh, really, is the fact we're a one stop shop. We're from the ground up here. We start with our chassis. It starts here and ends here. We put the first bolt on here and the last bolt on. And that really means a lot. So that allows us to do a lot of customization. Every coach is built from the ground up for that coach, meaning that when we start a chassis, it's for that particular motorhome. This is a front entry coach. We also offer mid entry coaches. So therefore that chassis will be different. Also along with that custom, that chassis we have, we have 25,000 pound towing capacity, 605 horsepower X15 Cummings engine, 4,000 Allison transmission, that combination is going to give you 1,950 pounds of torque. So this coach right here is a beast. You can do a lot with it. Not only can you have the powertrain, you also have the top-notch interior design with the most space, the most room, top-notch products, along with the best exterior paint anyone can have. The combination of designer Ryan Louts on top of Tim and our paint department, guys. There's nobody better in the industry. Then we're also going to talk about inside the coach. Look how big these slides are. Those floors are flush, whether they're in or out. The ceilings are taller. They're over seven feet tall in the ceiling, six feet, four inches tall in the slide. So most of people can stand inside the slide, get the most space, big slides, bring big windows, big TVs, more freedom of what we can do to customize your liking. That's just the coach itself. Now you got to get to our support. Our customer service is the best. Nobody has customer service like Newell Coach has. We have preferred service centers all over the country. Here at Newell Coach in Miami, we might be cent we're centrally located in the United States. We have a great 24-hour line as well. You call anytime, whether you bought the Newell from us or a private party wholesaler, it don't matter. Once you buy a Newell, you're a part of the Newell family. Service department will take care of you no matter what. On top of that, our customers are just the best. Our customers are great. Our Newell rally, we just had a hometown rally here just a few months ago, and everybody gets along really well. We have a great, fun crowd. The Newell family is probably one of the best. No matter where they're from, they all come together. We all have a great common bond, and really our customer base is just amazing. A lot of value. And talking about your customers, they push you guys to the next level they too. Do. You had some very passionate owners that push yeah. you guys, which pushes the entire industry. So I'm always honored to be able to come here and capture what you guys are up to. So. Well, yeah, and one thing I do, I am most proud about working here at Newell Coach. My other job, I would always hear, I worked at a dealership. Why don't the manufacturer listen to the customer? Where at Newell, the customers are building the coaches. We take their dream, we make it a reality. So a lot, that's why I keep saying all the time, you hear me say it all the time, Andrew, our customers come up with some of the greatest ideas and we're just able to take advantage of it. But our people here at Newell Coach, I got to talk a lot about them because that's another reason to buy Newell. The people that build these coaches, they take, put pride and effort into it like no one else in the industry. There's a certain amount of pride wearing Newell on your chest and they love 
putting out these beautiful coaches. They love a challenge. They love the fact that our customers do challenges. Look at this particular coach right here we're looking at. From the floor to the ceiling, everything's custom. The Whiskey Barrel Lazy Susan to the pegs for the wine. Everything's custom done. They wanted more countertop space. We figured it out. We even wanted to bring the porcelain backsplash over to this corner right here. Yeah. This corner with a nice spice rack. That's what the customer wanted. Our people, the people here at Newell Coach are the ones that deliver. So we really want to thank everyone here because they do an amazing job. And we're so lucky to be here in Miami, Oklahoma. People ask why we're in Miami, Oklahoma. We're centrally located in the United States, very centrally located for everyone, but really it's the people around here that make the difference. Yes, sir, I have to tip my hat to all the team here at Newell Coach. It's always an honor to be able to capture these beautiful creations, just next level. Yeah. Going back to this galley here, I'm noticing a white microwave that kind of ties in. Is that something newer? You have different options you can choose from your front of how your microwave will look with a nice little brass fitting right here. Tied in very well with what the customer picked for their cabinet colors. I really like the farm sink as well. A lot, a lot of countertop space with the Invisa cooktop just adds more countertop space. But also as we come here, we did show off this with the Invisa cooktop, but we also have a nice silverware drawer as well. You're talking about the galley. I got something else to show you off. Yes, back sir. Here that kind of ties into the kitchen. We have our standard GE monogram refrigerator, big hinges, and you have the locking door so it does lock while you're in transit. Okay. So it does not come open, but we have our ice tray in our freezer right here, but also we put two beverage drawers in this motorhome. The customer wanted a little bit more refrigerator space we were able to offer with some great refrigerator drawers right below the pantry. And what we did with this pantry right here, we put a little, uh, they do have a couple little kits. They wouldn't be able to put some stuff up there where the kids couldn't reach. Okay. Yet, so we made a nice little uh, top drawer right there. Very easy closing drawer. But also we did adjustable shelves here as well. Nice. So you can maximize the pantry space. As you come through, you look right across in the pantry, you have a beautiful half bath with a nice 3D tile along with the bidet uh, automatic lift toilet seat in the half bath for guests. Yeah, I love this accent wall we've started to see in a couple coaches. Yeah. And then this style of the cabinets below the sink with that countertop. And in this coach, that shape of that sink almost kind of resembles that yeah. whiskey barrel. This once again, just a great idea to kind of flow and have a little fun. So much flow in this coach, the way it all it ties really together. Is. This is gonna be a beautiful coach. And I really hope you guys can get out and see it at Tampa because it's really, the video, you do a great job, Andrew, but sitting in person is something else. It's n just another level. Yeah, nothing like the human eyes. As you can see, we did a true king-size bed, 72 by 78 in this particular motorhome. So we don't have the coat closets per se beside each one because it's an eight foot, six inch long slot. But we did put a coat closet right across for travel mode right here directly across so when you walk in you can still have something while in transit they decided to once again fill the whole window up with a 65 inch tv really big uh tv what that did was it gave them the advantage nice indirect lighting through here to show the porcelain countertop the same countertop that's in the uh galley but gave them four really big drawers nice that pull all the way out so really a lot of storage throughout and another closet right here a hanging closet with a nice lighted led so whenever you open up the door you have nice lighting we've got to close that door going to the bathroom there because we kind of glazed over something back here this accent wall I yes we have done this before in one of our earlier coaches it's really caught on it's a really nice design amber came up with it a couple years ago and some people chose to use it and it really is nice brought that all the way back here into the bedroom so it has this nice wall consistent through there as you head back into the master bath. So go into master bath. Really, really neat things. Once again, let's start at the floor. We have a nice slate tile look, but you see that nice river rock as the accent down there by the toe kick. Really cool, just something Amber and the customer came up with. Let's come back here through the bedroom to the main bath. You have wall mounted faucets. Yeah, beautiful. Really nice, good sink here so it does not splash. And um, it's got a little kind of a, a cool shape to it. It's not yeah. quite as symmetrical, but gives it a cool style there. Gives it a very cool style, very, very cool. 
Now, if we come up top, this is pretty neat. These things kind of have a little free flow as we go through. Yeah, really cool lights there. Swinging around, we're going to see how well it holds up, but we've done well with testing so far. Really anxious to see that. Once again, it's taking it to the edge for the customer, what they may want. We also have great storage throughout, and that's another thing Newell's known for. Here's our storage throughout the coach, and have a nice little laundry hamper right here even, nice. to go to accommodate your beautiful front end loader washer dryer. Yeah, and, and th these river rocks, this camera does not do justice about how cool that looks just when you stand here. It's such a cool look. I definitely recommend checking this coach out at the camper show if you have a chance and a heated towel bar yeah, there as well. Kind of, that's a new standard. We've been doing that for a few years now. Let's not forget about the great closet space you have yeah, in the back as well. Yeah. Your cedar line closet. So once again, storage is just one of the meaty neat things that Newell offers. We offer a lot of storage. A lot of our customers are full timers. Yes, sir. And they enjoy uh, getting out on the road instead of staying in their house. So this is their house. Once again, big shower, tall. This right is a really a bigger than our standard shower. It's exactly 42 inches in length and 33 inches in width. Really a big shower, residential. Even have a nice little ledge area there for ladies to shave their legs, along with a nice shower cutty here for your shampoos, soaps, etc. Now we will be mounting a, another faucet here for the height of what the customer may want. So when the customer comes here to do their wall through, we'll set that and hang that for them. Well, Josh, I appreciate the opportunity to get this sneak preview of this 2025. Now, if someone is a serious and qualified buyer and either want to purchase a new Newell coach or a pre-owned Newell coach, who can they get a hold of? Get a hold of me. Call me anytime. My name is Josh Schneider. Call me at 918-542-3344. My extension is 201. Also, don't forget to check us out on our website at www.newellcoach.com. Awesome, Josh. I greatly appreciate you and the team at Newell. Also greatly appreciate all of you out there subscribing to the channel. We hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Safe travels.